Hello the people, I am Mr. Neo and you can call me M-Page. This is a quick video that I wanted to make by testing this new camcorder. It's supposed to shoot in full HD at 60 FPS. You probably won't see it if you're looking at it through a lower resolution to like save data or whatever, but if you're looking at this with the highest settings with the best equipment you can possibly get, I hope you won't be disappointed. So what am I going to do for this video? Well, I'm going to show off my old recording setup because I'll probably be retiring it soon. Okay, so what you're seeing right now is the laptop where I film everything. There's a little picture of me. Hi. It is currently in the camera app. And it uses, you see the little light there? It's right next to a 720p webcam. I don't know if you can see it that well, but right here that's the 720p webcam and that's how I record my face. Um, I recently adopted a method where I would record the footage of the player with game DVR but I used to like download the video either before or after reacting so I can like be able to import it into the editor and I will now show you the editing setup. And while I wait for that to load I might as well show you some stuff around the room. Here's a Xbox One, Xbox 360, uh, you got a PS1, PS2, Blu-ray player, satellite box, DVD VCR combo. My Wii is somewhere in this mess of wires down there. Shame. This over here is my wall of retirement. This is where I put my Guitar Hero guitars that are either having technical problems or are just straight up no longer functioning brings back good memories looking at these. I'm hoping if I do this right it'll give me 1080p footage at 60 FPS. Now this is what a typical project for an for an episode of the Neo show looks like. Over here on the lower track broken up into separate bits and pieces is the footage of me and sometimes I'm with Cactus Chris as well. And on the higher track is where I put my other footage such as the V I'm reacting to or some other supplementary footage like the Wheel of Wonder which I just introduced in this video if it will focus please I guess it's not going to focus right now so yeah by using this camcorder I hope to change my setup a bit instead of capturing my footage of myself with the webcam I would be using this and it's especially easy because I can turn the miter around and I'm essentially in selfie mode, which means if I were to switch arms and turn it back to myself, hi, then it would likely show me clearer. Why is the lighting so bad? Is there a way I can change that? It's on auto. Um, I don't know if this is accurate. Okay, uh, getting the light in the shot seems to have fixed it slightly. Yeah, I still have some learning to do. I'm going to be using this camera a lot while I'm at TriCon and the journey to and from there to record some stuff. So prepare yourselves for some glorious footage if I can get this to import correctly. This right here on top of the one is a Gears of War controller. I bought it from Cactus Chris because my controller that I got with the system was malfunctioning. Um, some Xbox One disc games over here, Rock Band 4 and Guitar Hero Live. So now you know my feelings on rhythm games. Um, 3DS, I rarely play it anymore, but when I do, you'll find you'll probably find me playing Tomodachi Life, but not so much because I haven't played on it in years. And um, I also play Super Smash Bros. or Mario Kart 7. I really gotta see if I can still find those cartridges. Um, Here's Defender Jaguar, somewhere in this pile. Here's a book that I keep telling myself I should read. Like, I bought this at Walmart, but I never bothered to read it. Diary of a Wimpy Kid Double Down. Maybe I'll bring it with me on the trip so I have something to keep me not bored on the car ride. It's for chatting on Xbox Live on the One. This is a Turtle Beach headset. Pretty cheap Turtle Beach headset at that, but okay. This right here is how I capture my audio for videos. It is a PDP rock band microphone that I actually got for free on a mail-in rebate offer with the rock band for Jaguar bundle. 
but you can still purchase it on their website for thirty dollars I will warn you that the audio does come out kinda quiet so you should boost it if you are using a video editor and you'll notice that the audio sounds different right now that's because I'm not using this mic I am using the mic included with the camera um... what can we find over here why it's my Donkey Kong Gabongos hiding under a laptop charger and also a tripod I plan on bringing this is my um... internet box spongebob alarm clock uh, old computer monitor, old printer. This is the TV on which I do all my computer stuff. Uh, my weapon of choice in guitar battles, Mr. Explorer over here. The stickers were stuck on by the previous owner, not me. And here's Princess Luna looking glorious and sparklier than ever. Here is a trophy that I won in West Branch's Got Talents in 2015. For third place, I sang Beautiful Girls by Sean Kingston. The video was originally on Facebook, but it got taken down for copyright. Uh, some assorted cartridges and CDs. Yeah, if you're a hardcore collector, you probably hate me right now. This is a Pebble smartwatch, one of the very first models. The, I have an issue with the screen that will occasionally tear and screw up unless I hold on to the bottom of it for some reason. And a lot of people say you can like unscrew it, open it up and fix it yourself, but I unfortunately when I bought this it was a refurbished version of one of the Kickstarter models which did not have uh, screws so I'm screwed. Rock Band 3 keyboards, I rarely ever use them. The Closet of Shame. Got little Pac-Man joystick thingy-mabobber down here. I'll occasionally still play it if I'm at a house with an old TV that accepts composite inputs. There's Scooby-Doo up there. What, whoa, Rackle? Your room is variously a rocking mess! Don't I know it. Wii U Pro Controller, in case I get in the mood to play Super Smash Bros. or Mario Kart comes in handy except not now because it is dead. Game Boy Advance. This is actually the Game Boy Advance I owned as a child. The hinge on the battery door is broken so we just stuck it on with tape. Maybe I'll bring this on the car ride. My ticket for TrotCon. I'm not showing you the barcode for obvious reasons. Of course you could forget my bag of ponies. I, I plan on adding more to this bag soon. There's Tavia. You hurt me now, but I won't cry. I am a daddy. Here's a Lyra. Anthropology. Then there's Vinyl. Drop the bass. Whoops, 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 Whoosh, whoosh, I'm a Wonderbolt, bitch. This red bundle of miracles right here is a Toshiba external hard drive, two terabytes of capacity. When I downloaded all the Improbables episodes, I stored them right here. This device is a blessing and a curse. Now, like, I have no idea which USB ports on my laptop are USB 3. Like, nowadays I'll plug the hard drive into this port because it actually works correctly but then I'll get complaints that it's not a USB 3 port but I used to plug it into this side because I thought there was a USB 3 port there turns out not only was it not a USB 3 port but it also screwed up a lot of my data transfers which is why episode 6 has no audio after a certain point again very sorry and that's about it for this collection of randomness I hope you enjoyed me testing this camcorder out, and I hope you get as much enjoyment out of this video as I did making it. I'd like to thank you all for watching, and I'll see you soon. Peace.